Erica Stefanko found guilty of once again for her role in pizza delivery case Erica Stefanko shook head sadly Wednesday afternoon when she heard the jury convicted her again for role in the pizza delivery case. Ashley Biggs' mother, Kimberly Biggs, cried tears of joy in the front row of the Summit County courtroom. Biggs made an emotional statement after the verdict was read. Justice has been served. Jeff Laburn, one of Stefanko's attorneys, was disappointed with the verdict the jurors reached after two days of deliberation. These are hard to win. Jurors found Stefanko guilty of aggravated and in the 2012 strangulation and beating death of Ashley Biggs. Stefanko faces life in prison and the only question is whether he will have a chance at parole. Thursday by Summit County Common Pleas Judge Jennifer Toll. She was sentenced to life imprisonment with parole 30 years after her first trial. Stefanko, 41, of Rittman, plans to appeal. Stefanko was convicted of the same charges at his first trial in November 2020, but was granted a new trial when the appeals court ruled that Stefanko's ex-husband Chad Cobb, who is serving a life sentence for killing Biggs, should not be tried. They were allowed to testify via video. Stefanko testified at his second trial, which was different from his first, and claimed he made a fake pizza delivery call to lure Biggs, 25, of Jackson Township, to the location where he was killed. However, she denied having any knowledge of or taking part in the Stefanko arrested seven years after Biggs Stefanko was arrested November 2019 after New Franklin. Detectives said new information had come to light about his involvement in the June 2012 killing of Biggs the parking lot of a closed New Franklin business. This included Stefanko making a fake call Domino's, where Biggs was the delivery driver, to lure Biggs the location where he was killed. Biggs was tasered beaten and strangled with a zip ties. At the time of Biggs, she and Cobb were in the middle of a heated custody dispute over their then seven-year-old daughter. Cobb accepted a plea deal 2013 in which he pleaded guilty to aggravated and several other charges. Exchange for avoiding the death penalty. Stefanko was found guilty of aggravated and following a trial in November 2020 which took place at a time when few trials were ongoing due to the COVID-19 pandemic. His conviction was overturned in July 2022, with the appeals court focusing on Cobb's remote testimony. Cobb claims Stefanko shares blame in Biggs Cobb, who attended the hearing in person, testified for more than six hours at Stefanko's retrial last week. Cobb said he used a stun gun on Biggs and beat him severely. But Stefanko put a zip tie around Biggs' neck, hands and feet. Cobb said Erica was in a relationship with her longtime close friend and employee, Mike Stefanko, and that she learned she was pregnant with Mike's child while in prison. Cobb, 42, is trying to withdraw his plea in his case. But that wreck.